Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, I'll be doing a review of the third build of the LEGO Crater 3-in-1 set, 31028, which is the seaplane, catamaran, and swamp boat. In this video, I'll be re reviewing the swamp boat. This is the box for it. Um, it's, it's only a small little box. It was a pocket money set back in the day, and you've got, and you, and you got three little nice builds off it. And the instruction manual is just one instruction manual. As you can see, you've got all three builds there. I've done the other two builds on previous videos and done reviews as well. So this is the current, this is the swamp boat um, as it's meant to be built. As you can see, it can accommodate a Lego figure, which is which is quite nice. You can probably move these bits out and the Lego figure could sit in it, which 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 would work slightly better, which I might try and do, um, which I might try and do instead of a custom build, but I haven't got that far yet. So as you can see, it's got the moving parts on it, which is the propeller on the back, so it looks like a swamp boat. It's got the base of the boat there. It's, a good, it's got a good solid, um, good solid base on it. It's got like um, a power lever there. Um, and there isn't, a lot, there isn't a lot you can really say about it. It's a good, it's a good little build for what it is. It's, it seems to be like the sort of thing that if I was given a few bricks, sort of thing I would probably build as well. I probably wouldn't go for a swamp boat. I'd probably gone for a battleship myself, but Lego can't. Lego can't really do that, or maybe an aircraft carriage or that. But Lego can't do that again. So, but 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 that's a Lego issue, and and there isn't much point in speculating on that because 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 the good thing about Lego is you can build what you like with it, which is which is which is really good. And Lego can be very. Um, and ambiguous, ambiguous about certain, certain part bricks and stuff like that. So, um, for example, the space Lego could have, you could convert the scanners into lasers, radar dishes into lasers as well. Just, just a bit of imagination can go a very long way. And James Bond car had a spare exhaust part as well, which could double up as a gun. But that's another story for another day. But as you can see, this is a good little build. It's good, it feels solid, it feels solid. I still think the seaplane is the main event from this set because it just works really, really well. The Cassin Ram was nice, but the uh, but the seaplane really the seaplane really does swing it. But this boat is nice because with a bit of modifications, you probably mod it out quite nicely and put it into your um, Le um, Lego River Police set, which we which would be quite cool, and it does feel a bit more solid than the um, other sets as well. So, so, uh, so there's not much more to say about this. The moving parts, it ticks, it does tick a lot of boxes, and it and it is fun. So, which would, which would, which is the whole point of the exercise to begin with. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, do feel free to like, share, and subscribe. I am on YouTube, Instagram, and Threads. If you'd like a shout out on the channel, uh, all you have to do is leave a kind or constructive comment at the end of the video and, and you'll get a shout out. Pe um, um, pe people have shown support for the channel this week. Uh, Mathcraft Lopez, thank you very much for your support and I hope it continues. M Michael Davis, thank you very much for subscribing, very much appreciated. Um, K banana underscore cat. Um, thank you very much. Uh, thank you, very, thank you very much for your kind comments. Very much appreciated. And Melina Schmidt, hello. Um, stay safe. Keep building, and hope to see you in upcoming video. Thank you for watching.